And one of the main issues I wanted to highlight today is the lack of participation of women in the industry. It's a lack of education or barriers to education that many girls face at a young age, such as poverty, child marriage, and gender-biased violence. That varies, of course, between communities and countries, but most importantly, that do not enable the same equal access for girls and boys at a young age. And it compounds into many other factors that would not enable them to have the proper training and skills to join the financial industry if they decide to at a later stage. I applied to the position when I, it was after a long, tedious job hunting season that resulted that uh, ended with no result. I applied with a lot of voices in the back telling me that I'm not going to get the position. This is a trading internship and women are emotional. I decided to join finance to inspire other people like me and let them know that even they can land stellar Wall Street jobs. It's the drive to carve out a path for more women, especially from the Middle East, to take on Wall Street and pursue similar roles and jobs that makes me want to go to work every day. What drove me to be in this field are the endless opportunities for growth my career provides me with. Working alongside brilliant minds in this space, both females and males alike, widens my perspective and my way of analyzing things. We were four interns and I was the only female. At the back of my mind, I was questioning, did I land this because I was good or competent or because I'm a female and they have a quota? So I worked hard day and night in order to prove to myself that I'm competent enough. However, I got my answer at the, enter at the end of the internship when I was the only one out of the four interns to get this job offer. As a companies and societies, we need to start signaling that both men and women can take on non-traditional role at home and in the workplace. We must always strive to exceed clients' expectations by giving women a more active role in decision making. Despite these troubling and trying times, one must not forget the imperative role that women play in creating and adding value to clients. One of the many successes I find in my career is that difference is nurtured and even encouraged. Different perspectives and varying opinions are welcome, no matter the gender, no matter the age. No matter what they tell you, women are emotional, women cannot be traitors, women can be only on the client-facing kind of uh, jobs, I will tell them no. So how has my experience been like for me as a female in finance? Mind-opening and trusting that females are meant to be in finance just as much as males.